939. The class of 2021 is filled with success stories and students who are determined to push through the stress of a school year like no other in order to graduate. One local family is especially proud this morning. You're about to meet twins, Jonathan and Janaea. And one is the valedictorian at Bodine High School and the other is the salutatorian at Bodine High School for International Affairs. Listen. Not about how good you are, not about how talented you are, or how much you changed in the years, but sometimes when things aren't going right, there are times when anything that can happen will happen. And although today marks a significant moment in my life, I truly believe we have merely scratched the surface of our potential. See, I wasn't very smart in my class, uh, and I've already screwed up your name, Janaya. Is it Janaya? Janaya. I oh, Janaya. I'm, obviously, Sorry. it's Janaya. I said Janaya. <laughs> Sorry, I was told differently. My bad. <laughs> okay, and Jonathan, did I screw up the name Jonathan? <laughs> Jonathan is correct. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, uh, let's get to business here. Who was born first? Um, I was. Woohoo! By how many minutes or seconds? Uh, just one minute apart. One minute apart. Okay. Wow. So who's the valedictorian? Jonathan, I'm the valedictorian. <laughs> he jumps in right away. So how do they choose valedictorian salute? Is it all grade point average, uh, Janaea? Yes, it's all based on grade point average. And we surprisingly were just a couple of points away from each other, which is how we became the top of our class. I oh, hear that it was really close though, <laughs> Jonathan. Yes, it was, it was so close. When we had picked up our transcripts and I looked, I was like, Oh my goodness, like we were like so close <laughs> with each other. Just like, you know, how we was born, we were like a minute apart. So GPA wise was like a couple seconds. Wow. wow. So what has it been like then? Have you always been competitive then when you were in school, trying to get those grades and see who's gonna beat each other? Um, yes, we've always tried to compete with one another, especially academic wise, because we always took most of the same classes together. So we just felt if we pushed each other hard enough, we could possibly be the top of our class. Yeah. And we did that. Uh, we did that. Where'd you both grow up? I guess you grew up together. <laughs> yes. <laughs> um, in North Philadelphia, and we went to um, Kearney Elementary oh, School, yeah. Six and Fairmount, so not too far from Bodine. We have pictures on the screen right now. The two of you as babies. So cute. <laughs> Do you I have any siblings? I'm sorry. Yes, we have an older sister oh. who lives in Texas. <laughs> oh, okay. very nice. Uh, so what was it like for the family? I mean, did they pick sides? Or they're like, we're just going to wait and see how this plays out. <laughs> we love them both. <laughs> um, they, they pretty much love us both. They don't pick sides at all. So it was like, you know, Every time one did the other, you know, it was the same thing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I wish I could have gone to the ceremony yesterday. Uh, Janae, what, what was your basic message in your speech? Um, my message was overall just reminiscing about the past four years we had with one another and that um, it's time to grow up now because life is going to hit us. Yep. It's going to hit us hard. Right so face. it's just, it's just yeah. um, time to just reminisce and then move on. With life. Jonathan, I need a 10 second answer on this. What was your message? So my message was that um, preparation is more important than planning is because you always need to prepare in life. Um, even if your plan doesn't go right, you always need to have, you know, say another idea or something else backing up. Like we were supposed to graduate on our there you um, go. 18th birthday, mm -hmm. but you know, at least we had a backup plan for June yeah. 15th, which was yesterday. So always having preparation or being prepared is the key and is important to life. Yeah, you never know when you get hit with a pandemic. Jonathan's yeah. going to Howard and Janae is gonna stay here at uh, Temple. Congratulations, Congratulations to you both. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Best of luck to you both.